Alright, so I'm back on Roblox, and today I'm playing, this is the first Halloween themed video of 2024. Today, I am playing Trick or Treat in Hollowsville 2. This is the sequel to the classic, which I did make a Roblox classic on the original one already. And I will do a video on that one next. Uh, but I want to do this one first, even though my date has been completely reset. I had a pet, all but one of the quests were done. So all this just reset for me for some reason. And it's just this account. I logged in on my alt and it my alt still had all the stats from before, so it's just my main. But I guess that's good, because since uh trick or treat is not the only thing that can be done in this game. It is the main thing, it's literally in the name, but it's not the only thing that can be done. So maybe it's a good thing at least for a video. And plus, it's like they're hard to they can just get them back easily, so. But yeah, that's definitely a little bit of a glitch there, that the, uh, yeah, this shows up twice. Any Craver. Enjoying this for first piece of candy? I'm sure you want more. Collect candy from 100 houses. Yep. That's one of these. So, yeah. I will start those other ones. Uh, at least one or two of them in this video. I don't know if I'm actually going to finish them. But, yeah. So, that's to me. The main crux of this game is, you know, trick or treating, essentially. Um, except it's just, uh, if, if you've played the original one ever, you can tell this is literally just modernized. Um, but the main crux of it is literally the same, so. But it does, like I said, there are other things. I will feature them in this. At least one or two of the other things. But, um, yeah, it's actually, actually, it's not just as simple as going around getting candy. Um, monsters can show up at these houses, and if that happens, you will lose candy. Um, so, yeah, that can't happen. And, uh, they're actually pretty easy to tell as a bunch of different ones. I do remember when this first came out, um... We still don't get that much candy compared to the first one. In the, in the OG, you can get like two to five was the average here. You can get one to three, but three is like the max for some reason. I don't know why three is the max. Excuse me, there's that. That's yeah. There's one piece of candy, just one more. Eat 50 pieces of candy to complete this quest and satisfy your sweet tooth. Yeah. Of course, I haven't gone trick or treating, and uh, actually, this will be in my ninth year. Here's a monster, and all a candy was taken away. Nice. Anyway, I haven't gone trick or treating in like nine years. Yeah, cause I think yeah no ten. Yeah, cause ten years. Cause the last time I did it was 2014. So I haven't I haven't trick or treated since I was 12. I stopped when I was 13. Why? I don't know. I just felt it wasn't for me anymore. But once I turned 13, I just didn't want to do it anymore. Can't tell you why, but I don't tell you, I don't regret that decision. It makes Halloween a lot easier for me. I can just sit back and relax. <laughs> but I can still trick or treat in a video game because it's a video game. You're never too old for video games. So there you go. And the best part now is, as an adult, you can go and buy your own candy. You don't you don't have to ask people for it now. Sure, it's free as a kid, but you can just go buy it now. You don't have to ask anybody. It's all yours. So that's the win. And here's another monster. And that one took five. Yeah, that is one thing I do with the critique. Like the penalty for these monsters are so harsh compared to the amount you get. It looks like it looks like a, I remember Critique in that years ago looks like that still hasn't changed and I don't think it's gonna especially since back in the spawn There's a vehicle thing. There's like a thing for vehicles that uh, For coming that says coming soon opening soon. It's been a few years Like two or three years and it still hasn't been completed. So I'm honestly at this point I doubt it's ever gonna be finished I doubt it's gonna be finished but there's a lot of people playing this, as well as the original. I'm surprised how much people are playing this one, I really am. That is surprising, I gotta say, usually the original is more popular than this one, even today. But both 
this version and the OG version have like, it's like a cult, I don't know, yeah, cult following. It's like a very small player base. It's a very small player base that plays it. I'm in that player base, but it's a very small amount. I remember back 10 years ago, Trick or Treat and Hollowsville, the original, would make it to the front page every year. From like, oh, I, I, I want to say 2013, 14, 15, maybe, si I don't know about 16. I think 16 or 15 might have been the last year it was on the front page. And then after that, it just never got back to where he was, player count wise. It just didn't. Which is unfortunate, but at the same time, it makes sense. This game is, even the this, even the second, the sequel, it is unbelievably simple. Bro, he just took 10 fucking pizzas of candy. I had to go through like several houses to get that, and one monster just, like fucking Thanos snapped that out of existence. Come on, man, that's not fair. Yeah, so that hasn't changed, unfortunately. But whatever. Nothing I can do about it, so I'm not going to complain about it. It's honestly not even worth complaining about. It's like an inconvenience, really. But the uh, exchange doesn't make sense. It doesn't fit, I don't think. So I am going to go through most... I don't want to say the full map. I'm going to say, like, a lot of houses. And then I'll do a couple of the other quests, I guess, while I'm doing this. Up ahead, I know those, like, the street turns up there. Then I'll, I'll round back to, like, the center there. And start a couple... And start a couple of the other quests. So that while I'm trick or treating, I can also do those. Uh, at the same time. So. And, uh, again, I'm not gonna put all of them in this video. But I am going to complete at least one of those other ones. At least one. Looks like it turns already, so I technically can go back already. Hasn't even been that long though, so no, I'm not doing that yet. Yeah, so I'm gonna head down here. Yeah. I'll go to this house first, then go turn on the road there. So, yeah. I mean, Halloween for me has changed in those uh, 10 years since I saw Trigger Training. Now it's just been me playing Halloween themed video games, really, and on a Halloween night, I don't really do much. Honestly, I should create something to do. I don't know what though, but I should make something since every Halloween night I'm always open. Like I always have time to do something. So I gotta should find something to do. I'm not I'm not, I'm not into horror movies. Maybe make a play a scary game. Like an actual scary game, or maybe just live stream playing Halloween shit. I don't fucking know. Alright, that's that. So that's one of the quests right here. This is perfect. We'll start here. Hello there, traveler. Would you help me collect apples? Eek. Apple harvest. Mmm, caramel apples. Collect apples for the citizen so he can make enough caramel apples for the entire city. Apple trees are hidden around the map. Gather a hundred and report back to the citizen for a reward. Yep. Alright, that's one. That was start. And uh, yeah, you can tell the apple trees, like literally. Is it touch them or click? I don't know. I don't know if I remember to be honest with you. Let's see. No, yeah, you can buy costumes with in-game money. Same with uh, bags. I had one of those ones before my data reset. What is that? A wheel? I don't think I was there before. So in the center here, the tree, you can uh, do this. Please help me. I can't find my friends. A pumpkin was playing hide and seek with his friends, but you cannot find them. Search for his friends on the map. Once you find all six, report back. What was cool in the original version is that the pumpkin was like custom built. It was blocky, but it was custom built. And the pumpkin had a sad face on, and the rest of his friends had a happy face. I don't think this was here before, was it? I don't remember that being there. It could have been there before, and I just don't remember. But that's two. I want those apples. And this one, you can actually sprint. And so you can jump. Yeah, this is the vehicles I was talking about. Ghost wheels. Yeah, it's been that way ever since the sequel came out. It hasn't changed whatsoever. Uh, I can start a couple more, I think. Let's see. Okay, that's part of him. Yeah, that's Larry. This guy over here. Those mean house learners are putting Carlico, but I can't party. 
Poor Larry, he just wants to party, but the homeowners are putting up garlic to keep other vampires away. Find all four clothes and tell Larry where they are. He'll give you a reward. Well, it says right there what the reward will be. So it's not a mystery what you're going to get. It tells you. But yeah, I think that's three or four that we started. And there are others, but like I guess I'm not going to do all of them. And honestly, I don't know which one of these will be finished. I don't know which ones. A few of them, though. A few of them will be finished. This one can only hold 25 pieces. The, the bag I bought like a couple years back was a, a red bag that had a spider on it. And I picked that one because it fits, just, it fits my outfit, which is mostly red and black. That's why I picked that one. And plus it has like 200 like capacity with the candy or whatever. So it could hold a lot in it. So it wasn't, and so that is a nice thing that came with it too. That has no garlic on it. There's an apple tree there. Yeah, I'll head this way. Where the apple tree is. See any pumpkins around here? I don't see any. In the immediate area. So the answer is no. And also I'm gonna have a difference between this and the OGs and the original. Uh, you had to click up, you had to click on the pieces of candy to pick them up. In this version, you don't do that, which is nice, I guess. It does it's less work. Okay, so if I'm getting pretty lucky. So either that, yeah, that actually recovers a lot of stamina. None of these houses have garlic on it. And then again, there's only four across this big ass map, so that's, uh, yeah, it's pretty tough. Let's see how much it takes away. I think it's broken. Yeah, the witch just got stuck. Yeah, okay, she just got stuck. I'm just gonna move on. I don't know if it's gonna update later or something. Is she just stuck like that? Now is it gonna update? Okay, so it took eight away. She took eight away. That's nice. So that one's still a bug. It's interesting. I haven't seen that before because I don't think I've seen it before. So that is definitely interesting. Honestly, I don't think the devs of this game, I don't think they updated very much. Which I guess is fair considering that the only it's only um, public for like one month out of the fucking one month out in the fucking year. Open for only one month. October. And then it's uh, once October goes, it, it closes. So yeah, the, you can only play either of these versions during October, otherwise you can't play them. Where the fuck is the garlic? I want to find at least one goddamn thing. Where is the god- uh, there's an apple tree. I'm going to start doing more of the quest things. Thanks for a little bit. Where is the garlic where it's a pumpkin? Where is a pumpkin? Where is anything? Let's see, I'm pretty sure we saw some before, but I wasn't paying attention to which house specifically. Oh, there's a pumpkin, look at that, see? There's one. Pumpkin one, very clever, very nice name. Now oh, there's garlic, there's one. And yeah, that's good, so I found one for both. But, um... Yeah, so far that's it for those. There's another, I think, yeah, I think these apple trees are like the same ones. You just, I'll say they just respawn. So how many I, apple trees have I got already? Only eight out of a hundred. All right, that's going to take like forever. Well, forever for a video. So I'm not going to show that whole process. Let's see, is there any garlic here or a pumpkin? The pumpkins are always on the balconies. There's a pumpkin. Look at that. I passed two of them during this. So there's there's another one. I'm looking for garlic. Yeah, at least you can zoom out and look ahead for things, which is nice. There's garlic up there. I think that's three already. And then I'll just take a look. Oh, so I like the music is just great that just constantly plays on loop. Okay that's two not three. Never mind. Let me see. 
Oh, there's another pumpkin. I'm being followed. Alright, there's that one. Apparently it's in pumpkin number six. There is another apple tree. And those brain chairs, that's part of a quest. And those spider trolls are part of another quest. I'm really sure I'm not missing anything here. I don't think I am. I think goes under I think that's a, that's a quest as well. There's another apple tree. There's more. There's another garlic. I don't know. I, I do think this map is bigger than the original. Yeah, it's definitely bigger than the original map. For sure. It's definitely bigger. Um, I will in the spare time get all my shit back that I lost. Which I shouldn't have lost. I still don't know why that occurred. Where is another pumpkin, huh? There's one up there. Let me go stop here real quick. Hope to get some more candy. Also, I'm gonna get some more. One piece. That's real fucking nice. Heh. <laughs> Another pumpkin, though. So that's good. How many is that? How many is that out of six? Four. There's two left. Two pumpkins left. Those are everyone who's playing this has just left. There's a girl in cup ahead, I believe. But, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I still don't understand why my game never said. I did tweet out to the dev on Twitter, but, uh, like, I expected and got nothing, which was expected. I, I didn't think it was actually going to do anything, but I did anyway. Okay, there's number three. I need one more fertile area that he can go ahead and party all he wants without uh, anyone disturbing him with the garlic. Spaceman. Space robot? Maybe. Is that the last one? I don't know. I'll detect the menu. No, I think that's the fifth one that I found. Also, all the people in the houses have interesting uh, avatars. Yeah, that was the fifth one. There's one left. And there's another apple tree over here. Very nice indeed. Where's the last garlic, huh? I don't, know, I don't think you haven't been to this part of the map yet. Oh, there's one. Right over there. And the garlic is closer. Garlic. That's the fourth garlic. Very good. Good shit. Yep. Quit all for the quest. I don't know. Pumpkin! That's the last one. So that's two more quests I just completed. Well, two quests I just completed. So let's go back to the center. Go back to the spawn. I can go claim rewards and more apple trees. Alright, Larry. We did what you wanted. It's time to party! Have a gift for your troubles. I got way more candy than I can even hold. And $20. Wait, can I go buy... Hang on, let me cut off the pumpkin next. Can I buy a larger bag? I don't have money for that. Thank you so much for finding my friends. Here's a reward. Even more candy that's, that I can fit in there. I want to keep this play, play session open. Can I buy a bigger bag? How much was this? Seven fifty. Are you shitting me? Okay, this one is fifty. That's thirty. That's one twenty-five. I'll buy this one. Okay, that one's one twenty-five. I don't know. You can sell candy. And make money for like NPCs on the streets, but let's go. Yeah, the hollow tree. Yeah. So this, this is where I'm gonna end the video here. This game is fun every year. I'm glad it comes out. It's tradition to play it every year. And uh, the next video is going to be on the original trick or treat in Hollowsville. So uh, look out for that one. But yeah, that's it.